Hi everyone, it's Akila. Welcome or welcome back to my channel. And today you'll get to see our family's night routine before the first day of school. Right now, me and August are figuring out what we're gonna have for dinner. We definitely have pizza way too much. Same for hot dogs and hamburgers. Do you have any ideas on what I should make, August? We should have a salad and spaghetti. You know, that actually sounds really good. And throw in some of them famous meatballs. Good idea. Okay, um, let me make sure we have all the ingredients. We did just do some back to school shopping, so we should. Perfect, we have all of the ingredients for spaghetti and meatballs, which means August, you can start on the salad. Okay, so right now I'm grilling the meatballs and they smell so good and looks like August is back there done with the salad. Just go ahead and put it on the table. Okay, perfect, the spaghetti and meatballs are done and it looks really good. Wait a minute, do I see Leo reading? Wait a minute, boy, don't tell me this is your summer reading. You didn't finish it? Listen, who's trying to read during summer? I mean, obviously it doesn't sound fun, but it was assigned to you. And I also believe you told me you had to write an essay on it. This is the second summer you have done this. I swear you've done it before. Mom, I'm gonna get it done. Leo, I expect better from you. You better get it done too, because you're gonna make me look bad about this school. I will, I just got caught up doing other things. Like what? Trying to play lover boy? Anyways, can I get back to reading? Y'all are distracting me. Hey girls, dinner's ready. Come get some before I eat it all. Hi daddy. Hi live bug. Hi dad. Hi Leah. My tummy is gurgling and growling and screaming. Y'all look so cute in your PJs. Thank you. I do. Maybe not Leah. Hey, that wasn't nice, Liv. Livy, let's be nice. Hey, Leah, do you think you can get drinks for everyone? Yeah, sure. Wow, everything looks great. Thank you for the drinks, Leah, and thank you for the salad, August. Well, before we start eating, I have a question. What are you guys all excited for about this new school year? I'm thinking of stepping out of my comfort zone and running for class president. You really do have some great leadership qualities and I'm glad to hear that you wanna be a leader and not a follower. Cause you can see where being a follower has got you. Yeah, yeah. Well, anyways, do you have any ideas for your campaign slogan? You have to have one. Yeah, I actually do. I use it on all the ladies. Okay, and what's that? No need to fear, your boy Leo's here. Oh, okay, Um, it's definitely catchy. You got this, buddy. I remember my days as class president. Well, I'm thinking of joining cheer. Oh, you wanna be a cheerleader? That would be so good for you because you're really good at dance and gymnastics. I could definitely see you being a flyer or something. I know, right? Cheer? I know a couple of moves that'll help you make the team. You're not a little girl. Oh no, dad, we don't need to see that. Sure you do. And what exactly is that? I'm confused. My little eyes, they hurt so bad from your dancing. Go team, go, run the ball. Y'all know that was good. Okay, okay, my turn now. I'm super duper excited to play in the sandbox with my friends, do my gymnastics, and being the bestest girl ever. Yeah, we love a humble queen. But no, seriously, Livy, that sounds great. I'm really glad you're so excited. Who made this salad? This is so good. Okay, so we finished dinner, it was really amazing, and now I am just going to go ahead and grab the dishes.
Okay, so I finally finished clearing the table off. So let's go ahead and start doing these dishes. Okay, well, since we're done with that, kids, I think we need to come and start making your um, lunches for tomorrow. Dad, I don't know why you're standing around. She said kids. I got my yellow one. I'm a kid too. You're a ripe man. Not too much on the age. Me and your dad are really close. And make sure you fill up your water bottles too. Make sure you add some ice as well so they stay cold. It's going to be hot tomorrow. Ooh, can I please have some chicken nuggets and strawberries? I want a pizza slice and three cookies. Three cookies? What you mean three cookies? I'm bringing some for my friends. Oh, okay, that makes sense. They better actually be for your friends, too. Where's the strawberries, Mommy? I can get them, Liv. I kind of want to make a protein shake for Jim. Dad, come here real quick. Look in this container and tell me what you see. You left a scoop of powder in there. I did? Nobody else in this house using the protein powder. I could have sworn there was a half a thing left in there. Don't even worry about it. We'll get more. Welp. This shake is about to be watered down. So I went ahead and just put the orange in front of Leah's lunchbox because I don't think it's going to fit in there. It's going to get really smushed and there's no space in her actual lunchbox container. I forgot to tell you to get more protein powder. Mommy, how should I pack this? I'll be sure to remember it in the morning. I'll just put a post-it note on the fridge and then we'll heat it up in the oven and then I'll wrap it in some foil. We don't want to heat it up now because it's going to be all yucky by the morning. Wait, don't I have a slice of my birthday cake left? Oh yeah, I think you do. That can be your treat. You can share it with me, Leo. What do I look like sharing this little slice of cake? So for my lunch, I have a sandwich and in that same section, there's um a hard-boiled egg. And then I had a slice of cake left from my birthday, so I packed that. And then there's some yogurt and um, a couple orange slices for a snack. And on the side, I have a bag of chips and, of course, my protein shake. For my first day of school lunch, I have a slice of pepperoni pizza. And then in the other section, there's a salad with some cucumbers, tomatoes, and some cubes of cheese. And then on the side, I have some ranch for my salad, but also for my pizza too. Comment down below and let me know if you put ranch on your pizza. I also have three cookies, one for me and then two for my besties. And then on the side, I have an orange and my water bottle. This is my kindergarten lunch. I have six chicken nuggies, not the dino ones, but we have some ketchup packets on the side. And then mommy put in some yogurt and banana slices, even though I didn't want them. And I have strawberries, which I asked for. And then there's also cheese and crackers. So we have some chalky milk and my water bottle. Well, I should head to bed. I gotta get up early for work tomorrow. Night, night, daddy. Night, dad. Good night, dad. Okay, so obviously August went to bed and the kids' lunches are all packed, but um, I just need to check the laundry to make sure their uniforms are ready to go because I wanna have a very smooth morning tomorrow. Oh, hey, mommy. Hey, Leah. Okay, I see you guys getting ready. Livy, now what did I tell you about being up on the counters? That's not safe. School's gonna be so fun tomorrow. Yes, I'm so excited. I like it. I feel like a princess. Well, you can be a princess from down below where you won't fall down and crack your head open or something. You already have a broken arm. All right, let's make sure you go potty, okay? Oh, that would be bad. Mm-hmm, here, go potty while I go and check on this laundry. I don't need to potty. Yes, you do. Because you had an accident not too long ago. Sorry for putting your business out there, but it happened. Mommy, shh. That's not true. Well, just try, okay? Maybe you don't have to go now, but when you sit down, you will have to. I know that happens to me sometimes. Okay, fine. All right. Now, let me see if y'all's uniforms are... Oh. I didn't even wash them. I did not wash them. I need to... 
clearly do that now. Alright, cool. Fresh uniforms for the kids. So, let me go ahead and leave these up on y'all's beds. Help! I need help ripping this tissue to wipe my bum bum! Uh, at least we know the fiber's working. Alright, let me go leave these upstairs. Boy, be so for real. Seriously? I thought you had to write a report on the book that you didn't even finish reading. Look, I'm not gonna force you to follow the girl's bedtime because... Obviously, you're older than them, but um, I'm gonna need you to get it all done before you go to school. Okay, I will. All right, I'm trusting you because you can't be class president and you ain't even doing your schoolwork. Now, here is your uniform. I'm putting it on the bed. Wait, what's going on over here? Were you going to make like a campaign poster? Yeah, I've tried multiple times. Oh, well, why didn't you just ask me? I would love to help you. You know this is my thing. Okay, after I put the girls to bed, I will come back in and we can try to work up an idea. And maybe we can make it on like an app instead of having to draw it all out. That'd be a lot better. Oh, say less. Okay, we'll work on that. It might not get finished tonight, but campaigns aren't even until the second week of school. So yeah, there's your uniform, hang it up. Appreciate you, mom. Okay, Livy, let's go ahead and um, I'll put your uniform in your closet over here and I'll get you all dressed in the morning. We don't have to set your alarm or anything because I am going to just come in and wake you up. And then I'll be right back. Let me go and give Leah her uniform real quick. Leah, are you in your room? Oh, there she is. Okay, perfect. Here's your uniform. And here, let's close your curtains and make sure that your phone is charged. Is it charging over here? You know it is. Great, you're so responsible. But, um, okay, great. Um, Let's set your alarm. There we go, all set. I'm gonna go say goodnight to your sister first and I'll be right back. I hope you sleep well, Livy Bug, and have good dreams. And I'll see you in the morning for your first day of kindergarten. It's gonna be great, I promise, honey. Night, night, mommy. Okay, Leah, I tucked in Livy and I can't believe you're gonna be in fifth grade. Okay, talk to me. How are you feeling for real? Are you a little nervous? Are you just excited? A little nervous. Well, don't worry. It's gonna be great. Even better than fourth grade. Cause now you're at the top. And next year is middle school and there's just so many activities. I believe the fifth graders are also going on a lot of field trips this year. And of course, I'm gonna chaperone so I can go on them with you if you want me to. If you don't, it's okay, because I know that might not be cool or whatever, but I'm just so proud of you. You are so responsible, so smart, and just amazing, and you're gonna do so well. I'm scared because you're not gonna be my teacher anymore. Well, I'm sure your new teacher is gonna love you just as much as I do. It's gonna be great, I promise. And if you really don't like a teacher, you know, we can, we can switch some things around. After a week though, you have to give it a try. Okay, thanks, Mom. You're the best. All right, have a good night. Don't stay up too late. Okay, Leo, well, your sisters are asleep, so I just wanted to come in and say good night to my big boy. What SZA said? Boy, can you just can you just say good night to me? Dang. I'm closing your curtains, too. I don't need nobody. No peeping toms, nothing. Mm-mm. Night, Mom. Good night. And remember what I said. Oh, let me set your alarm, too. Can you turn my light off on your way out, please? So you can ruin your eyesight by playing games in the dark? Uh-uh. No. Get off. Actually, get off the game. You need to finish that book. Seriously. Because it's already getting late. Okay, in five minutes. I can't pause the game. All right, all right. Okay. Five minutes. And I'll be up in here to check after... I get ready for bed. Oh my lord. Okay, everyone. Well, that is going to be it for our back to school night routine. I hope you enjoyed watching. If you did, please feel free to leave a big thumbs up and subscribe to my channel down below. Once you are subscribed, click the bell button so you get notified whenever I post a video. Stay tuned for the kids' first day of school. And with that being said, I'll see you guys next time. Bye. There's nothing personal.